welcome to the fabulous booth of Formosa. Ladies and gentlemen, that's welcome Teddy. Hi, Teddy. Hi. How are you today? Hi. Wow, so you have a super booth. So could you help us to know more about your design idea? Yes, this year we actually combined the evolution of Formosa's recycled technology and products into our booth. Oh, recycle and reuse. So how do you show on your booth? Yes, as you can see, most of our material we use in our booth are actually recyclable and uh -huh. reusable. But reusable is very important, though we always say recycle, recycle, but how to do after recycle is to reuse it. Yes, because reuse complete recycle. True, but how do we know from your product? Could you show us some example? Sure, let's see our garment behind us. This one is actually a uh, reflect to the uh -huh. trend that in the market right now because a lot of people are looking for single material because single material garment means easy recycle and e re easy recycle means easy to be reused. And then this garment is actually the only one in the market right now that is actually from the face fabric, film, and the lining are all made with nylon. And the film is actually award this year 2023 German IF Design Award. Wow, congratulations! Thank you! And also, I have a question about this one. Is it also the normal material? Yes, it's also a mono material. This one is made with recycled polyester fabric and the trim is also made from recycled polyester from bottles. Wow, yes. from this model? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and also the zipper, right? Yes, yes. Wow, amazing. So yeah, that is the goal. That's the goal. We complete the garment with single material including fabric to train even the sewing line. That would be the best scenario for any garment company including our biggest brand right now. Wow, this is so important and that's the new trend of the world. Can yes. we have more example about this? Yeah, sure. Like the grey t-shirt inside uh -huh. this down vest, wow. that is actually coming from carbon capture polyester. Carbon capture means we gather the waste gas in the air coming from the steel mill. Yes, those heavy industry wheels waste gas actually can be transformed into the raw material of polyester. Wow, that's Moving so on. friendly to the air. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yes. Next one, okay, this, this one is, is actually Patagonia's uh -huh. down jacket. This one is actually made from 100% fiction net in the ocean. Yes, basically we collect all the waste fiction net in the ocean and made it into yarn and fabric and then our customer Patagonia, they made it into this fabulous down jacket. Let me make sure again, it's 100% from the fishing net. Yes, yes, talk about oh marine conservation. That is definitely very symbolic product. And also stunning. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much for sharing so much um, good material from the waste and we recycle, reuse it. But we are also have a question. Yes. Do we have any material from bio? Yeah, sure. Oh. Yes. Can we, we take a look? Yeah, sure. Okay, let's go. So here comes the biomaterial area. This one is the biomaterial product. So could you know more about this one? Yeah. Uh, this one is actually BioBase PA11. Uh -huh. It's actually made from 100% castor oil. So it's definitely a very good example of replacing all the oil resources with other alternative source. Wow, so it's still the mono material because it's, it's 100%. Right? Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's still mono material. And by the way, it's bio-based mono material. Wow, so bio-based can make it similar. No, it's exactly the same like how you feel about what made from patrol, right? Yes, even better, you can actually reduce some carbon emission with uh -huh. this product. So what is the next one? This? 
Yes, this one is actually a stretch version of bio-based products. This one is bio-based spandex. Wow. You can feel it, the texture okay. and the elasticity is exactly wow. the same like conventional spandex. So, if you prefer something more eco-friendly, but you probably are not ready for recycled spandex, then I think bio-based spandex is a very good start. True. You can tell, you can tell. If you don't tell me this is bio-based, I would never think of it. Amazing. Yes. So, what about the process? We know you cared about the product. We yes. know you cared about the environment. But in the process, you will always eliminate a lot of pollution, right? So yeah. how do we do with this? Well, actually, that is a kind of like a more old perspective for the uh, our industry because right now we are trying to improve and reduce a lot of pollution as well. Okay, this one is actually water-based PU. This jacket actually treated with a less harmful solvent instead of the traditional old solvent. However, in terms of performance, it's still very competitive. So, yes, right now, all functional textile in terms of a treatment will slowly moving on to a more green production-oriented design. Wow, green production, I like the word. Yes. <laughs> and also, talking about the process. Yes. Do we have any new ideas to share about the process? We know we make the environmental friendly. Yes. We will have a friendly process of making textile, right? Yes, because Formosa actually is one of the first company to install solar power system. Yes in Taiwan mm -hmm. and uh, we will continue to make our process including retire all boiler to something like LPG boiler and basically introduce more green power into our power supply system so you not only if choosing for Mosa Tafta you not only having all this access to new recycled material you can also Sure, make sure, ensure you can have a green production. Wow, so I'm looking forward to know what is the next for Formosa last, next year? Yes, next year we will have more stretch, eco-friendly version including bio-based or recycle, both in mechanical stretch and spandex. And also we will have, I think a lot of people are anticipating for that, uh, next year, we will have recycled polyester from textile waste. A uh, recycle, including like a waste bridge to waste use the fabric, and most importantly, garment recycle. So make sure stay tuned to our next step. Wow! So, ladies and gentlemen, we are not just looking for recycle anymore. We're looking for reuse and mono material. More of that. We have biomaterial and yes. the better process of function textiles. Yes. So ladies and gentlemen, if you're looking for something greener and better, you are going to Formosa Tafta.